there's got to be another way. Randy, we can't keep this a secret anymore. You know that doesn't work. No, please! Wait, come on, come on, we agreed. It has no, to be done you can't. this way. Hey, you can't. hey, we have to. We have to. No, Randy. I will, Jesse. I'll tell everybody that I killed Henry North. What? What do you mean? You killed North? Yes. And your father helped me cover it up. She's just mad. She don't know what she's talking about. No, I know what I'm talking about. And I will tell the entire world if any of you try and take that baby from me. My God. I've been feeling guilty about hiding an abandoned baby. This whole time? You've been covering up a murder? Natalia. No. Natalia. No, stay wait, away. Wait. Obviously, there's an explanation for this. Hey, why did you do that? Because you left me no choice. If I lose this baby, I don't care about going to prison. Yeah, let me... Stop. Listen, he, he's probably just so upset because you're so upset. Why don't you let Frankie take him, all right, and, and just try to quiet him? He probably just needs a change. I won't take him out of the apartment. I promise. That's it. I'm gonna go change him, okay? Look, I'm not crazy, so you can just save your stories about doing the right thing for somebody else. I've heard everyone's arguments. They don't understand. Matthew belongs with me, Angie. Randy, I do understand how you feel. But listen to me, sometimes you have to look past what you're feeling and think about what's right for that baby. Now, you 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 just can't just give him any kind of life while you're trying to run and hide with him. What I kind of life would that be? I love him. I know, oh, sweetheart, I know you do, but sometimes loving a child isn't enough. Love is probably the most important thing that you can give a child. But just as important as love is security. Because that baby wants to feel safe. Now, if you don't turn him over to the authorities, if you try and run with him, sweetheart, you're going to be running for the rest of your life. You're going to be hiding for the rest of your life. And more important, you're going to be hiding and running for the rest of his. What kind of existence would that be for either one of you? I want you to do something for me. I want you to think back to when you met Frankie. What was your life like then? Scary. I was always afraid that I was going to end up beaten or dead with a disease or pregnant. I think that's what I was most scared of. <laughs> I knew that I could never bring a baby into this world that I was living. Angie, when I met Frankie, when we got pregnant, <sighs> I was still scared. It wasn't until I looked into Matthew's eyes that I, I realized I really wanted to be a mother. When I look in his eyes, I don't see any judgment, just love, just innocence. When I hold him in my arms, I don't think about anything besides that baby. 
my past. Henry, it all disappears. Angie, don't you see why I need him? I do. I certainly do, because to come upon a child like that is it's a gift from God. And whatever is meant to be, will be. And in the meantime, you've got Frankie to hold on to. And you have Jesse and me and Natalia. And we will do whatever we can to protect you. But now I need you to trust us. Okay? And you try and you do right by that baby. remember when I came home and I saw you and Matthew together for the first time. The look on your face, I fell in love with you all over again. I've never seen you so at peace, so happy, so beautiful. I want to make this I want to fix this. I want the baby with us so that you'll always have that look in your face. But if this isn't the way, Randy, if if someone is out there looking for him. They are. Frankie, I've known it all along. I've just been denying it. Every time I look in his eyes, I know that there is someone out there aching, dying, because they don't know where he is. <sighs> whoever, whoever it is, I know that they're going to miss him just as much as I am. When I let him go. <laughs> He's ready to go. We'll take my car to the station, okay? I can't. What I mean is, I, I, I don't want to go to the station. I have to say goodbye now. You sure? You're going to be just fine. Whoever lost you, they're going to find you again. And you're going to be right where you're supposed to be. But I... But I'll never forget what you did for me. I just want you to be happy. I love you, Matthew. Thank you.